Hello everyone. Today I received a package all the way from Toronto. Uh, this was sent by one of my friend. His name is Basan Tapa. So thanks to him, I'm able to make this video. So in this video, I will show what is inside and what am I going to use this item for. So let's go. These are the cables where you set up uh, the fans and all. You can set up anything, LED light and things. And I think this is the Raspberry Pi. And here this uh, micro SD card adapter. And the moment we are waiting for guys, Raspberry Pi model. Raspberry Pi 4 model B So this is the Raspberry Pi model B Here is the SD card where you set up the OS and this the Ethernet um, port where you give internet connection and these are the USB port where you can connect your mouse, keyboard or anything you want which is having USB cable and this one, these two are the micro HDMI cables these are not the normal HDMI cables so this is the micro HDMI cables and here you give the power supply and this is the chip or a spirit by so let's set up the raspberry OS into it let's go so before diving into the mining what we need to do is uh, first you need a micro SD card and an adapter or you can use the micro SD card directly in your PC to set up a uh, OS either you can download Windows Ubuntu and other OS but um, for now we will try to set up a Raspberry o OS into this SD card so let's go and one more thing, you need a micro HDMI converter. So this this two slot is HDMI, but the thing is this is micro. And here the HDMI cable goes. So micro HDMI to HDMI converter. So let's set up the OS here. Let's go. So first we go to Google and here in the top we type in raspberry pi imager raspberry image here okay click on here and click the raspberry pi software and we get to this website so when you scroll a little bit down you see download for windows so you just have to click on it and as you can see it down it started downloading and click on this downloaded file run it okay next i accept the agreement next next and next and 
is finished so when you get to this raspberry pi imager you choose uh, operating system you click here and you have to wait a little bit after a few minutes uh, it will show the devices which all devices are present and as you can see raspberry pi 5 4 0 3 2 1 yeah so ours is raspberry pi 4 model b click on it and operating system you we will choose raspberry pi 64 bit os and for the storage we will be using 32 gb sd card and click next and we need to edit setting here and go i have set everything username and the password and you have to give a wi-fi uh, wireless lin ssd and the password of your wi-fi as well but first we will set up the username and password my username will be easy 508 i have set up the password and here i have my wi-fi is it's already set up right and lane country is land country is uh, right now ca ca for canada and just click save would you like to apply os customization setting yes are you sure you want to continue okay yes and here we need to wait a bit i think it, it will take around uh, five to ten minutes to fully write the os into the sd card so let's wait And the good thing about this Raspberry Pi is right now I'm using to mine various coin but you can use Raspberry Pi for mining Bitcoin as well and even other coins and you uh, you can set up your Raspberry Pi for anything like making drones making robots even like uh, there is unlimited access to what you can do with the Raspberry Pi. So in future, I may use my Raspberry Pi for something else. But as of today, like I will use my Raspberry Pi for mining various coin. So let's see how much various coin I will mine by mining for one month straight. Okay, almost done now. Okay, we finished setting up the Raspberry Pi OS. Now you just need to close it and take out the SD card and put in the Raspberry Pi. So let's see. So we finally finished setting up the Raspberry OS into this SD card. So what we need to do is uh, put the Oh, it, uh, SD card here in the back slot. So let me do that. So we have put the SD card here and the HDMI converter here. So what we need to do is take out this HDMI and connect here. Let's see how it goes. So we need to give the power supply to the C, C cable power supply. So let's do this. So let's see how it boots up.
is trying to put up so that's it I think 64 bit Raspberry Pi OS welcome to the Raspberry Pi desktop is trying to set up the OS for my Raspberry so it'll take a few minutes to set up so let's wait yeah I think it's all done now so uh, the one thing I want to say is you can use this Raspberry for anything you can even set up as a like desktop you can use this for anything like to make other stuff like uh, Mars rover you can even try to make drones out of it or you can use it for other purpose anything so it's having unlimited potential to do stuff so let me try to connect uh, keyboard and mouse to this and let's try to mine various coin here so you just need to connect this reservoir by to a power supply and as you can see it's already booted so i'm gonna leave this here just to keep the temperature down and to keep the performance high and i will connect this reservoir by by using the IP address I will use my laptop to connect it so let's go so we are here in my laptop so we're gonna use a software called PuTTY uh, so basically we'll use an IP address from that Raspberry Pi and put it here in this software and we will access that Raspberry Pi from our laptop so let's put the IP address over here and uh, I will set up our name here and we are here we got the access you just need to give the user ID here and the password so I'm giving the password press enter okay I'm in now here you need to copy some code so I from chat GPT I use some code for mining uh, various coin I will leave, I will like put this code in the video, video description you can copy it from there so I'll copy it one by one it's just like uh, using the termux or the user land you just need to copy the code and just paste it and press enter and it will do its thing so let's try to do all the steps one by one and let's see how it goes will it be able to mine various coin or not Uh, almost done with the setup now now just like in Dermux and in user land here we need to set up your wallet address and the pool you want to use for mining various coin so here I will first put my wallet address and after that I'll put the bullet pool for mining various coin
and here uh, instead of this thread you just give uh, how much threads your uh, raspberry is having for me raspberry by four is having four so i entered four and uh that's it it started mining now and if you see the progress uh as you can see in the graph uh it goes up for raspberry by four i think it's having around uh four mega hash per second just like uh having one phone for now i'm gonna use this raspberry pi for mining various coin but but in future i may use this raspberry pi as a kind of desktop to monitor my mining progress and all so let's see what i will do with my raspberry pi in future so that's it for the video guys uh do give a thumbs up if you like the video and do subscribe to the channel if you are new to it and i will upload more content based upon the cryptos in the next video i will uh, i will show which all coins uh, right now to buy and which all coins is best to invest so stay tuned guys bye bye